Google Scholar can be a great resource to introduce yourself to different topics. However, try not to make it the only resource you use because it has a different way of defining what makes a journal scholarly and often doesn't pull in all of the journals that library databases do. That said, there are a couple things you can do to make your experience on Google Scholar more productive. I've done a quick search for social media and body image. Sometimes I'll see an article that interests me and I don't have that link to a PDF next to it. If I click on it, I'll see that it needs to be purchased for $39.95. Don't get out your credit card. Instead, I'm going to hit the back button and show you how to link UMass D Libraries to Google Scholar. Once you're back on the Google Scholar page, click the menu next to the Google Scholar logo on the top left side. Scroll down to settings and give it a click. From here, click on library links. Then type in UMass Dartmouth. Click search. And you'll see UMass Dartmouth pop up with the get it at UMass D option. Select that and click save. Now, instead of having a blank space next to the article I want to read, I have a Get It at UMass D link. If I give it a click, I'll be redirected to the article's record in the library catalog. Right below the title is the option to download the PDF. You may be prompted to log in with your My UMass D information if you're off campus, but once you do, you'll be redirected to the article in its entirety. From here, you can print and download it.